Hey there everybody, welcome back to the channel and today we're gonna talk about the bootlooping problem or issues on your Samsung Z Fold devices. Now let's say you try to turn your device on but you see your device, I mean your Z Fold devices on turn on, maybe stuck on the black screen or maybe keep bootlooping or maybe keep getting stuck on Samsung logos, okay? So if you are facing any of those issues which we have mentioned so far, then this is the video that you wanna watch. Because in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can solve all of this problem very easily. Alright guys, now to fix your problem, the first troubleshooting process that you want to do with your uh, Samsung Z Fold devices is simple. Now just go ahead and press that volume down button and the power button together and keep holding them unless you see the Samsung logo appears on your devices. This is really a simple process to do. If that helps you out, congratulations. But if that doesn't help you to fix your problem, you probably want to check out our second process. Alright guys, and this time all you have to do guys is go ahead and press that uh, volume up button and the power button together. You know, just go ahead and press them together and keep them holding unless you see that your boot menu comes on your screen. Okay, now just keep them holding. Now, once you come to your Android recovery mode here, um, you have to navigate by using your uh, volume up and down button and the power button. So here, I'm gonna just go ahead and just come down here and just keep up pressing your down button to come your wife cache partition, okay? Now, once you just come to this option, you simply need to press your power button once and just come to this ES option. And once again, press the power button and then what will happen, it will actually remove some of this cache which can cause that issue sometime. Now all you can do here guys, you simply can, you know, press your power button once to simply give you a reboot your system, okay? Now before I go ahead and do that, let me tell you more about this thing, okay? Now even after doing this process, if that doesn't help you to, you know, fix your problem, then lastly, you want to choose this option called Wipe Data and Factor Reset. Now before you go ahead and do it, you have to keep in mind because this is going to erase all of your information, including your photos, videos, and everything you have. So you have to be careful with that. And now if you agree, if you don't mind losing your file, then you can come down here and then you can press your uh, power button once. And then you can come to this option called factory and data reset. Now here it is giving you a little bit of warning, so be careful with that. And now simply go ahead and tap your power button one more time. And what will happen, it will actually you know, start deleting or just you know, removing all of the problem that can cause so far. You just go ahead and wait unless you were, it says data wipe complete. Now come down here again and once again press your power button just to reboot your system. Go ahead and press it once again and now it is going to take a little bit of time and it will start showing you the Samsung logo. Now wait unless you see your device is actually getting back to normal again. Alright guys, so after doing this process, as you guys can see or as you guys can tell, now our devices get back to work again and our problem has been solved, okay? So this is what you can do to your Samsung Z Fold devices to fix your problem. If you are facing, you know, let's say boot looping your own turn on or getting stuck on Samsung logo and then you'll be able to fix all of this problem right after doing this process, okay? So this is what you can do and this is how you can fix it. Hope this video is useful for you guys. If you think so, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching guys and hopefully we will see you again.